English language structure. Why is structure important? Firstly, structure is important for it is a means for writers to organise their texts. It is also important because structure can be manipulated by writers to help them further their purpose. For example, they can do this in non-fiction texts such as articles, as the writer may include a consistent thesis and conclusion to help the reader understand the writer's purpose greater and help them follow through with their arguments. Fiction writers can also use structure in their writing to try and entertain and interest the reader more greatly. When writing about structure, you will need to talk about how the writer had used structure to impose a particular effect on the reader. You will need to do this a lot in your English language, paper one, question three. Linear and non-linear structure in fiction writing. Linear structure are texts that are structured in a chronological order. These kind of texts will have a tendency to build up towards a climax. Non-linear structure are texts that do not actually occur in chronological order. Instead, they manipulate time to make texts much more interesting. Hence, they usually will use time shifts and flashbacks to make their texts much more interesting. Texts in this structure can start with a dramatic climax and work backwards from there in order to take, make the text more interesting. When writing about structure, you will have to consider and write about where the author has focused your attention and what effect this has. Examples. The writer could start with a broad description and then in the middle of the text shift to a particular character's experience. To talk about this, you might say that it helped draw in the reader by narrowing their focus, but it also had an effect on the reader for it shift their focus from the setting to the characters. Also, another example we could talk about is in non-fiction texts, the author may include an intro, main points and conclusion. This would have had an effect on the reader for it would help them follow the arguments and thus understand them better. Finally, an example is the writer can move from setting to setting. You might say that this has the effect on the reader of helping the reader feel as if they are on the journey with the characters, helping them engage with the text much more greatly. You will need to write about the effect of structure in English language GCSE. Below, I've put forward a short example of how you would answer a question based on structure. Please have a look and engage with it and read through the answer and see how the writer structured the text in order to interest you as a reader. Thank you. I hope you found this video useful. Support us by liking, subscribing and sharing with your friends. If you have any questions, post it on our forum at examqa.com.